if you're seeing this video definitely i've made all my research uh, the survey has done its job and this land is available for sale hi everyone welcome back to my channel today we're going for a farmland hunt so there is this farm i came to last year and actually someone said i should get it for him uh, but some things few things came up and we couldn't buy it and now we are back to this farm to check it out so last year that we came here i think that was before corona it was we we're told it's around 400 ish so we're back again to check it so i want to vlog it for you guys and if anyone is interested they could just eat me up so i don't know how much it's gonna be right now but let me show you guys and then i will tell you the price we're still walking there we're parked over there so it's not that far anyway so there is even a, a very old poultry close by and there is another poultry over there i'm gonna show you where there is a farm house there so let's keep going this is where it starts from and it goes down there I'm not gonna go inside so we have a very big space here there is another space over there you can see that's a whole poultry that I'm talking about and this place actually belongs to someone he wants to go and find out because the last time we came here we were told that is they want to sell everything they don't want to you know sell it acre by acre they just want to sell everything at once and it's going around something million maybe 20 maybe 12 or 20 something i've forgotten but he wants to go and find out now and I will, he's going to fill us in on how much they want to sell it okay let me just go and hear what they have to say about it so this is like a land for uh, a house for anybody managing the land to stay because this place is quite far from the city but it's not that far actually this place is not that far but when you're here you just you know you have to live here so that you can monitor whatever you're doing this is like how many acres six times 15 plots Mumbo. 16 acres, 16 acres. Uh, yeah, that is one egg, one Oh, uh -uh. sorry. 16 acre. acres. So you are talking of 15 plus now. What do you have in here? So let's one, go. one acre is and uh, one, one acre is two and a half acre. Uh -huh. So, so you know, good day, everyone. My name is Olua Shegun Davis. We are the land we are upon is is not too far from Federal College of Education Oshiele. It's just a 10 minutes drive from the college and not too far from the new railway the federal government is embarking upon and this land is very good for farming last year it was sold 400 400 000 naira per 
acre but this time around i think it's going for 450 but it is still negotiable i'm assuring you this land is not acquisition and no issue of a money lay. i am an officer and i've made my investigations i have like six acres here which i'm farming on and where, where we are is not far from there and as you can see behind me this is a penthouse on the 16 acres of land it has a borehole and other water facilities it goes for 15 million it's a very nice land anybody that wants it can just take the advantage so my my brother here will, will, i'll still take him around to see the land where we are was cleared last year for farming because due to the shortage of rains they couldn't do anything but this year i'm very sure they've started doing something preparing for the new farming season so let's just move around the land don't worry very close here you see where they plant oranges the palm oil and so on and so forth and they are very lovely we have security around see them for this same land i'm talking about you see the house there the security man is there so whatever you want to plant it is secured nobody will come and invade your land there is no s men around so your land is safe no issue of money at all like i said no problem on that that that's one of the things people are worried about <laughs> definitely i know i know that's why i'm stating that one categorically so let's just move around let's let's check the and the out. land the land is also free from a uh, acquisition yes. mm -hmm. it's even yes. it's even better because ah look at uh water leaf you can see it's a good land so like when you have officers who have made their research and all and they bought part of the land you should know that there won't be any problem so this is the old um, chicken or pen house see and there is a boat all over there that's the gp town yeah so if you just want to acquire this place, you have lesser job to do. Yeah. And that's a drilling. Yeah, this is nice. So this is the farmland. So this is your space, right? Yes. So this, this place you're seeing right now is actually what we came for. Yes. But now we, as I've told you before, the last time we came here, those people said that place is up for sale, so we just try to join it to the video, man. So if anyone is interested, there's still land, there's still space, you can see. Wow. As many as, as many acres as you want. You hear? As many acres as you want. Or even nectar, so just let me know the price is not that much <clears throat> so guys about this uh, particular land uh, which is uh, 16 acres and it's going for 15 million naira so what actually makes it, makes it that expensive is because of the bottle and this pen here so like They've done a lot of stuff there. There is one over there. There is one over there. So those are, and the house as well. Everything goes with it. So that's why it's a little bit high. Yeah, there's a little fish pond there. So even if you have this place, you can do anything you want on it. And you won't even have the problem of this or money layer or you have to pay some particular dues for some people every year or something so that's what makes it uh, a little bit expensive okay. Yeah. 
Sir, but right here, you don't know how many acres that are remaining. Yes. Mm, but there are still many. Okay. We still have enough to buy. All right, all right. We have enough. At least. But, uh, we still have as many as possible. But I will try and confirm from that believer. All right. Please confirm and let me know so. Uh, I can put it in the video. Okay, you sold like two acres around this side. Out of that, my two. Okay, okay, out of here. I just sold on this side. The other two. I don't have, you know for it. Alright. Okay, at the back. I do not. From here, the last are from here. Okay. So I bought from here. See it's inside. Oh, okay. So it continues like that. All right. It's even better. It's closer to the main road. To the main road there. Guys, we are inside, and wow. Yes. Okay, these are the boundaries. So they planted this tree purposely here, just to recognize the boundary. And look, everything is green, man. So. We are going out now. Uh, this is nice. So well, guys, remind me to wear sneakers anytime I'm coming to check a land space out. <laughs> oh dear. Just yeah, got a little injured. The seeds that I bought, this is where it started from. Okay. The, the pillar is there. The pillar, yeah. Okay, this is acres that you bought. Alright. Straight down like this. Like this? Vertical. Yeah, okay. Down. This. So you can see that's more or less like a. Like a yes, yeah. yes, there is. Yeah. So. So whatever we want to buy, we just keep moving yeah. like that. I understand. Yeah. So there is a pathway here. Yeah, exactly. There's a pathway there. So from where we were coming from, yes, down to this down place, to this then place. Straight, straight, straight up down. like that. Okay. So that's the... And that's why these trees are... Exactly, the size of the boundary. Interesting. So we have to make our way out. So guys, this place is in Abeokuta and it's even closer than you think. Uh, it's closer than the ones I've seen in Obada, uh, Kobakwe, sorry. So Kobakwe is a little bit far, but this place is quite close. So if you need something, 
I think if you need a farmland, I think this place will be a very good option because there are people around, you'll be safe, you won't need to be scared of anything strange or dangerous happening to you or your farmers, so or your workers, I mean. So I think this place is cool. Yeah, so now we're moving out and on our way going, as he has said, that there are some palm trees, plantation, orange plantation, cassava and all. So I'm going to show you, we're going to, on our way going, we'll pack and I'm going to record it for you guys to see. So that next time if you want to come, you can even have an idea of what to see when you come here. There's a stream that passed through this place. The last time we came here, there was a lot of water here. So I guess it dried up because there was no rain. So when rain starts falling now, you see, you have enough water there. But you can't depend on that actually. So you need to get your bore hole set up or even if it's a small well. That's why the other farm is a little bit expensive because there is a ready-made ball over there. So guys, there is a poultry farm over there. I don't know if you can hear the sound. So there is a small house for those walking over there. And that's the poultry. So you can see you have you already have neighbors. <laughs> So you don't you you don't have to be scared of anything. So we parked over there and we're going. Hi everyone. So if you're seeing this video, definitely I've made all my research. Uh, the survey has done his job and. This land is available for sale. So we came here yesterday to check it out, but I, I did not bring my Sovio. So right now, I, uh, when I got home yesterday, I spoke with him. So he said he needs to come and check it out to get the coordinates and then he's gonna check it if it's under acquisition or not, if it's a land we can sell. So he's here with me. He's gonna do, hi. yeah, he's saying hi. So he's going to do his job, he's going to check if the land is okay for sale. So I'm going to fill it in later. Let's keep going, let's check and let's see what we can do here. It starts from that side. Yeah, yeah, there is. Let's go inside. Alright, do you want to go inside a little? Okay. Yo, come on, Lata. Okay, come on. Come on. I just got tested. Caribi. Ah. 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 Oh, <laughs> I'm This is correct palm white. Bale sheta. Bale sheta. So sorry about the reflection of the light. So I just heard that if they want to extract palm wine from this thing, they have to cut it from the ground. Oh, the boy wants to show in the camera. <laughs> Do like this. Yeah, so they have to cut it from the ground and then they will extract the palm wine from it. So that means the tree is dead. Well, this is a palm fruit tree and those are the importance of this tree. These things have like a lot of qualities. So here that we are is not quite far from the farm that we're just coming from. And look at this. This is a palm tree plantation. This is quite large. This is quite big. But it's not as big as the one I went to one time like that. But sorry, I couldn't. I made a video there, but you know, the owner one doesn't want it to be, you know. I just had to delete it. Anyway, 
Let me show you. The palm wine is amazing, trust me. Ah. I'm a I'm a test. Ah. Mm. Mm. 